Hi, I'm Ari Schwartz and I'm a harpist from Chicago, Illinois. Today you're going to learn a little bit about my instrument and I'll be sharing some of my favorite music. Just in case you've never seen a harp before, this is what it looks like. The harp is a big string instrument shaped like a triangle. It has many strings that run from the neck at the top to the soundboard at the bottom. Harpists pluck these strings to make sound, like this. Most harps also have levers or pedals, which help change the notes of the string. The harp I play is a modern pedal harp. It has 47 strings and seven pedals. The harp is one of the oldest instruments in the whole world. It dates back to 3000 BC, and it was even depicted on the sides of ancient Egyptian tombs and in Mesopotamian culture. The harp has been Ireland's national symbol since the 13th century, and compared to other string instruments, the harp is actually easier to learn because there's no bowing or fretting. Also, harpists use only eight fingers compared to pianists that use all 10. Most people don't use their pinky fingers because they're too short to reach the strings. Bowing is how a violin or a cello is played, using a long rod called a bow. And fretting is something you do to create sound when playing stringed instruments like a guitar or a violin. You're about to watch me perform a piece of music called Chanson dans la nuit by a composer named Carlos Salzedo. The title means Song in the Night, and the music imagines a nighttime scene with a dance in the distance. I love this piece because it shows how many cool techniques the harp can do. See if you can count how many different sound effects are in this piece. <laughs> 